Welcome, folks, to Farming Simulator 2022. If you are new, I'm Super Dave, and this game just released this morning. I can't wait to get started, guys. So let's hop right in to career mode. We are going to start off with um, easy. I normally do play hard, but we want to progress uh, and not be five episodes on the same field trying to sell the same stuff. So we are going to put it on easy just to make sure we are progressing at a pretty good rate here, guys. Uh, so let's go in and we are going to do these. This looks like a really good logging map. And this looks pretty hilly. And this doesn't look bad. This looks like a good bounce. So we're going to start with Elm Creek, guys. Also, I have changed the settings around a little bit. We'll go right into that when we get in after we create a character. There is a new character dealio at the beginning. Also, load times are super quick on this game. As you can see, we're basically already ready to go. So let's go ahead and pop in. Um, I am going to build my character with you guys really quick. Um, nothing too fancy. I'm just going to try to kind of be bland and make it probably as close as I can to what I normally look like. Uh, so, if you guys don't know, some of my first videos on the channel were actually farming simulator videos. Um, believe it or not. So... Uh, this is a game I know pretty well, and, well, obviously not this version of it, but in the years past, let's get this cowboy hat black, and uh, you would be shocked to find out this is uh, pretty close to what I actually look like. <laughs> I'm not as stiff, I guess, standing looking, so let's go ahead and put that on as well. Um... Would you like a short guided tour? We'll show you the basics of the game. Yes, until it bugs me. And it has already bugged me. Okay, guys. So, first things first, before we even leave the farm, let's take a look at the map. Oh, that is not what I had. Oh, uh, no, I don't want to sleep. Let's, uh, let's just regroup here. And we are going to go ahead into our settings, actually. We're going to take down, turn down. You can see I've already switched it to dollars, miles, Fahrenheit, because I am a uh, dumb American that refuses to use the metric system. Actually, that's not true. We use it on Fishing Planet. I'm pretty familiar with the metric system. I also realize it's a much smarter system. All right, so we needed to, I can't remember where it is. We're going to drop this time scale right down here to real time right off the bat um and it looks like there's seasons i can't wait for that um is i in, live in wisconsin and we have definitely have the four seasons and grew up on a dairy farm so this is going to be really interesting to see how they've made snow affect uh everything it looks like we have this is our map here, guys, and what's planted in it on the right-hand side, if you guys are new to Fish and Planet. And we are going to zoom in, because it looks like we only have these three little mini fields, of which it looks like we have wheat planted in, and nothing implanted in this one. Also, we're going to have some tractors. We're going to go look at some of the new stuff. Look at all this, guys, though. We have sorghum. Uh, grapes, olives, poplar trees. These are all the crops we can do. I am super pumped. Um, there's already some right off the bat that are new from last year's game. Cotton, sorghum, grapes, and olives are new. And poplar trees are new. We've had trees and logging, but they weren't poplar trees. And we're going to get into all aspects of the game in this Let's Play. So first we're going to start off with the little farming. we got to get over to our tractors. Um, really quick, let's take a quick look at the tractors. Oh my gosh, that is cool. Huh. That is interesting. That's a, just a little guy. I have never seen one of them in real life. 
And I live in the middle of Wisconsin where there's a ton of dairy farms, as you might assume. Well, I live in the very top of Wisconsin where there's a lot of dairy farms. Um, all right. I So we have a lot of cool stuff. I did happen to look at something that I thought was really neat. Um, let's go in there and check it out. Was it in slurry tanks? No, there was just something new. We could do, where is the wagons? Auger wagons. Look at this. Does that not look huge? Like, I'm really curious on this playthrough to actually see all this new equipment. And I know this sounds dumb, but I always like to summarize. So let's go ahead and take a look in here. 500 horse Mac. Ooh, it looks like Mac and Man got the brands in here. And I think this is the one I know we're going to like down the road. That thing is fancy. All right. So let's get started, guys. I just wanted to take a gander at some of that stuff. So first off, let's get in our tractors. Let's zoom out here. Might be a little loud. Let's go ahead and attach this head. So you do start out with equipment in this game. Normally, I would... Um, un let's unfurl this loader, but normally I would actually go buy some different equipment right away. Even on hard mode, you can do that. And we are going to do straw, so we're going to show you in the, uh, probably show you in the next episode. I don't know if we'll get to it in this episode, but we are going to do the straw. It is a good way, especially if you're on hard um, and this is actually my first time ever playing on easy, so I'm really curious to see how it goes. Looks like, too, we start in August. So I don't think, if this is reality, we can't plant, you don't ever plant in August. So let's go ahead and stop that, make our, sure, straw pile doesn't go all crazy. Let's turn off the harvester for a second. And in series past, you guys know, if you've been around the channel, I do not like hiring workers. But this wee season, we are going to hire some workers just so it isn't boring. I want to have fun with this series and want to make sure you guys are having fun as well. So we've got this guy. We're uh, we are combining this field here. Let's get this straightened out just a hair. Looks like this is a very early game harvester. Obviously, like you would normally start, our equipment is all going to be early game. Um, I'm going to go ahead, and we're going to hire a worker. So an AI guy is now in control of this. And you guys can see right here, he's going to he's gonna be a little slower than me. He's going to lift it up and, and back up, and then he's going to take this turn. I'm curious to see how he's going to take this turn when he gets by the house here. Okay, so he's doing okay. Oh, and he just left a mess. All right, will you, okay, the guided tour already is annoying me. And also, you're ruining my field. Oh, yeah, that's a big no-no-no when you're farming. You don't want to just do that. All right, no, we got this. Okay, this guide was already annoying me. You need to stop. All right, let's go ahead. What is this over here? I'm sure this is part of the tour. All right. Yep, yep. All right, we're going to just kind of ignore that stuff. Let's go. We should have some other vehicles. All right, this is going to be our cultivator. So once, if you guys are unaware about regular... Um, oh, that weight just went too far into the ground. If you guys are unaware of how... Um, the, whoop, let's lower that. If you are unaware about farming in reality, once your field is done, you either have to plow or cultivate it, get rid of all that crap that's in the field from before, and we are going to go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and, uh, lift it. And something we're going to do down the road for the people that are, um, you know, used to fish or uh, farming simulator is we are going to go ahead and we will be plowing these fields to make them more effective um this guy is super we're gonna have to upgrade our cultivator right away this is not something i'm going to be super thrilled about so let's go hire the worker here 
One thing to note too on a lot of equipment here, the weights are going to help keep the tractor have traction, especially on these front wheel assist tractors. So some of these tractors, the front axle actually helps, and <laughs> which is a big thing. Actually, in real life, when I grew up, we had a John Deere 4430 that didn't have it, and it makes it a lot harder to do like this job in particular. Um, and a 4555. So we will be using all tractor types. Let's go ahead and grab the weights. I actually don't use the weights a whole lot in the game, but we will use them. Now, this is this is the uh, curious thing. Lower cedar. Can we still play in August in the game? Yes. Oh, I like this. The game even tells you you're being a moron. Okay, that's epic. Okay, <laughs> let's go ahead and not be dumb then. And we're going to go ahead and go over here. While that guy is, oh, let's zoom out a little bit. Also, would really like to be able to turn my lights on. Um, so let's go ahead and put this over here. We're going to use this as our, like, parking lot. Okay. Um... Because we don't even know what we have for equipment yet. Alright, so we do have this. Let's hook it up. Oh, look at that. Okay, I want you guys to see that. This game gets better and better every year. Also, my character looks freaking awesome. And we got a Massey Ferguson, so not everything is John Deere. Check out them wires. Look at that. All your lines, your electrical lines, your hydraulic lines, they all hook up like that. All right, we're going to open the cover, and we're going to unload this guy really quick. Um, does it crops destroy when you drive through them? They absolutely do, so we're going to be careful. We're going to go down here, and this guy should unload right into us. Here, let's go over here. He should wait at the end of the field. We're going to get most of this in right here we got to get this crop out we're gonna have to figure out what crops we're gonna start with too on our season i also noticed that august we might have to go through the winter and i'm a little um i'm a little cautious of buying uh some stuff right now for winter because i don't know what winter is gonna entail so let's go right here um let's see how do we unload? Start overloading? That, that is interesting that they call it that. So let's go dump out some of our... What is this do we have in here? I think it's wheat, actually. Yeah. Okay, cool deal. And then I think there's going to be a menu that tells us how much we have of everything. Um, it wouldn't be there. It would be... Ooh. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to look at cabs, too. Um, so this will tell us what fields we are. Crop calendar. Oh, this is really cool. Uh, ooh. Oh, I love this. Oh, wow. I... So we could plant oil seed radish. Which would help our crops get so if you're looking down at the bottom that oil seed radish on the last one we can actually plant that so we may actually try to plant that that should help our crops 20 degrees celsius would you i thought we did the conversions all right can we go ahead yep so in storage you're seeing right here and this is really cool that they have the markets on the right hand side and what you have over on the left i do want to quickly let's take a gander um at settings again and make sure i did not miss something um because uh, i am seeing all metrics still unless the game is just like yeah you got to use metric Nope, I'm seeing nothing that says metric or imperial. Huh. Alright, that's okay though. We can deal with that. 
Um, and also, there's going to be a little hiccups in the game. So, um, actually, we're going to unfold the harvester. Or unfurl it, as I like to say. But anyway, let's go ahead. Grab. Let's get right here. Let's switch over to the harvester. Right here. And let's um, fold it up. Oh, wait. We got to pipe out first. Let's pipe out and get this bad boy empty. Fully empty. Perfect. And then let's fold this guy up because obviously we're not going to be doing any harvesting um, this rest of the season. Also, I see, what is that, water over there? And why are you walking on my land, good sir? Yeah, you better walk away. Run you over with this harvester. Be a third crop. We got humans to grow, too. Another crop, not a third crop. All right, this guy clearly is super fast, but I want to get him over in this area here quick. Um, I think we're going to see now. Let's get over here. Now we got him away. Also, we're going to have to buy a wash station to keep these clean. Let's check. Select, select. Oil radish seeds. I think we're going to be able to plant this, so let's go back. Also... Why is there no... That is disappointing. I would really like... Ah, okay. I would really like there to be where to turn the lights on. Doesn't seem like there's a spot to turn the lights on. Oh, it's probably because... Oh, the tool I have selected is a back. Okay. Um, what if we turn the front... No, it's still the same. All right, let's go ahead. Let's turn on the cedar, lower it. And I'm super pumped. We can get some red oil seed going. This is going to help our fields for next year. Also, what is with people walking on my land? All right, this seems to be our... I know this doesn't have our most power. Let's go ahead and hire a worker. Um, this tractor is actually got more power here so let's go ahead and pull this guy in but this guy as you can see let's zoom in a little bit here this guy is way older than this one um, also what is going on are you blocking him let's get you out of the way here all right let's get go get this guy unloaded and also, we are going to park this guy up. Alright, so I think... Let's start unloading. Alright, so... Real quickly, this shouldn't take long to unload this. Let's not make a mess out of everything. We'll put this over here by this. I want to organize them in the order that you would use them. So the planter or cultivator would go first. That's going to go way down here. Also, it seems like we have three tractors, which is a really good selection, honestly, um, to have. Can we buy in the market? Let's go down to cars. I am not seeing... Uh, this is something that's not making me super happy. Oh, okay, never mind. It's still here. We can build our farms. Oh, yes. Okay. We can upgrade our house. Ooh. Whoa, there seems to be... Um, how do we go right or left down here? Oh, there we go. Wow, Taylor Sugar Mill. Ooh, wow, there is so much to do in this game, guys. Oh, 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 we are going to have a blast. Okay, so let's go ahead. Oh, no, I am super pumped now. Let's go up. Let's go over to buildings. Um, we need to get to tools, because I feel like there it is. The most important piece of equipment in Farming Simulator. Um, let's put it, can we rotate it here? 
boom, and then how can we place it? Boom, just like that. So we can clean up. We're going to go show you this here. Probably end the episode. There is going to be so much stuff to do, guys. We can build factories and stuff now. That's crazy. Um, I didn't see a train on here, but that's okay. Um, I bet you there's probably a train we could get into later. Turn on this. Now, guys, I'm going to warn you ahead of time. In games past, this thing is super loud. Um, so activate hand tool. Oh, wow, they fixed it. It's not super loud. You see how this is getting cleaned up, though? I am a stickler about having clean equipment. There we go. So let's go ahead and get into the tractor. All right, let's put ye old John Deere. So I have this weird habit, too, in the game, guys, of naming tractors and i can already tell you this guy's gonna be old green because it looks like a old tractor from the 70s or 80s which i grew up with um and one we'll name it old green so where's new green all right new green is still planting away over here i think this is a good as any episode or to time to end the episode guys because of this being the first episode, guys, please like in if you're new to the channel, subscribe, and thumbs up. As you guys know, I don't normally mention that, but it is episode one, and it will help us out a lot. And I cannot wait, guys, to get into this game even farther down the road. I am just having a blast with it already. All right, guys, we'll see you next time. Have a good one.